pal Melissa praises Meg for genuine with Haz but you can't hide Meg's abuse of him like a puppet. Melissa McCarthy has spoken out about when she filmed a special video with Meghan Markle for her recent 40th birthday. The US actress joined forces with mum of two Meghan back in August to record a comical clip, in which Prince Harry can be seen juggling in the background. During Tuesday's edition of Lorraine, Ross King shared a pre-recorded interview that he'd done with Melissa recently and couldn't resist asking her about the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. That moment in that video, it seems so surreal. Was it like that for you? He said, referring to Meghan's memorable birthday video. You know what was so cute, I could tell that he had walked in because we were talking and then she went, oh hi, and her whole face lit up and I was like, did Prince Harry just walk in the room? And it was just so sweet and genuine, Melissa revealed. And then he ducked his head in and he's like, is it weird if I juggle? I'm like, it sure is and then I was like, what about standing outside that window? And he goes, that's what I was thinking, maybe I'm just standing out there for no reason juggling? And I was like, are you weird and funny to boot? I love anyone that will do something weird just for weird's sake so I was like, I tip my hat. Melissa added. In the video, which appears to show Meghan at her US mansion with her dog in the background, the former Suits actress announced an exciting new project, 40 by 40, which aims to get women back into the workplace with support from other women. Recently, the US publication released a glossy and heavily airbrushed cover on Harry's 37th birthday showing the Duke of Sussex stood behind his wife with his arms on her right shoulder in the icons section of the annual lineup alongside Naomi Osaka. Dolly Parton, Britney Spears, and Alexei Navalny. One critic claimed the cover photo reflected the power dynamic in the relationship, because Meghan is in front of her husband, tweeting, Wow, this photo speaks volumes. There is no hiding who's in control. On the cover Harry is dressed in all black and Meghan in all white on a terrace at their $14.65 million mansion and then in green smiling at each other and holding hands while walking through their estate in Montecito, California. In another image they are in matching grey office style clothes next to a window in outfits chosen by celebrity stylists Claire and Nina Holroth, who have recently dressed Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston, in pictures taken by Serbian pair Idukovic. But one critic, a fellow photographer, tweeted, terrible retouching job. They look CGI. Others wrote, this photo looks photoshopped. Also, the way they are positioned is very revealing, it's the Meghan show and Harry is just the supporting actor. One critic said, Harry looks completely awkward peering behind his wife like this. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle celebrated their third wedding anniversary in May by revealing plans to build a disaster relief center in India to help battle COVID-19 and heal the virus-ravaged nation in their tie-up with Jose Andres World Central Kitchen. Markle as a villainess that completely controls her husband Harry. Markle was controlling Harry's finances to keep him from leaving her. Markle was furious with Harry for posing with a sporty brunette at a polo match. Harry once remarked that royal life was like living in a fishbowl, he found the spotlight a bit less harsh when he went out without Markle. There is less awkwardness around him and he has a far more jovial, easygoing nature as opposed to giving out this vibe that the world is on his shoulders, the sauce dishes. Harry is still under Meghan's control and is predicted to be unable to escape control.